Assalamu alaikum friends in this video i will show you how to reinstall ssl certificate in your website as you can see that this is my website and the old ssl certificate has been expired so we need to install new ssl certificate first of all go to google and search ssl for free and click ok now select the first link sslforfree.com here first of all you need to verify your domain name copy your domain name and paste here to get your ssl certificate copy your domain name and paste here create free ssl certificate in the next step you need to create your new account to get ssl certificate i am going to register myself as a new user email and password and register yourself here in the next type here is a get start page click on new certificate here you need to enter your website domain name for which you want to get your ssl free certificate I am again going to copy and paste my website domain name here and click on the next step. there is a one year pro account and we want to get the 90 day certificate which is free of cost click on next step here in this step keep this auto regenerate csr option on it will regenerate our contact information automatically so click on next step here are the multiple plan so in this time we are going to choose free plan which is 90 days free ssl certificate click on next step in this step we need to verify our domain to get the free ssl certificate here this is my domain name So here we need to select the second option HTTPS file upload. In this step, here are three steps. First of all, we need to download the authentication file. This file we will upload in our web hosting account. Web hosting account should need this directory. And in third step, we will verify by clicking on this link. Let's start first download the authentication file and in the second step you need to go to your cpanel web hosting account and click on file manager in the file manager we need to create the new file directory where we will upload our authentication file click on public underscore html here create new file and the file name should be same as given in the step 2 dot well known paste it here and create new file now we need to click dot well known file and we will create another file inside it and the file name should be pki dash validation paste the file name here and click create new file 
Now in the next step, we need to upload our authentication file here. And click on upload file. Now select file. And upload this file in this new directory. Here you can see that our authentication file have been uploaded here you can see that this file has been uploaded here now we will need to verify this file go to in third step and click on this link here is the file content we just uploaded now go to next step in this step, we will verify our domain name in order to get the SSL certificate. Just click on verify domain. It will automatically verify your Here is the time to download the certificate zip file. Just click on the download certificate. So your certificate file has been downloaded in the zip file in the next step we will upload our certificate files in our web hosting account unzip these files and go to folder you can see that there are three files we will upload no go to your cpanel and under security section we need to click the ssl tsl option in this up in this first option private keys first of all we will upload our private key file in this section these are all certificate files we don't need these files anymore we don't need these files anymore let's delete all these files one by one then after that we will upload our new ssl certificate files choose file to upload select your private key file and click upload this file here here you can see that the key file have been uploaded now go back we need to go back to our cpanel home page in order to upload the new file again go to security section and choose the SSL TSL option and now this time we are going to upload the certificate file to select certificate files from the folder in the second number and upload this file in the certificate option scroll down and choose the upload new file choose the certificate file and hit open to upload the new file upload certificate congratulations your certificate have been uploaded here so here we go you can see that the our expiry date have been updated to three month more no choose file and upload the third file in the same option upload third file this is also a security certificate file now click on upload certificate so 
so now go back we have uploaded all our three files in the web hosting account now this time you need to go again to cpanel home page and again go to security panel and click on ssl icon in the third step this is the final step we just left now we will going to install our certificate files in this last and third step we will install our certificate files i have uploaded before this is the old CSSL certificate which have been expired earlier we need to uninstall this certificate then we will upload new certificate so here click your domain name and click auto install domain option now you can see that your SSL certificate have been installed automatically successfully this is the success message of the installation of SSL certificate for the three months now click ok here you can see that the expiration date have been updated search your website again Here we go you can see that our website have been secured and SSL certificate have been installed successfully. So friends if you feel this video helpful please don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel and press like button.